Right now here at 5.30, the athletes bearing all in the latest issue of ESPN, the magazine, including two local faces you may recognize. Well, ESPN's body issue hits the newsstands tomorrow, and in it, the athletes drop their inhibitions and pose nude for the cameras. In this year's issue, two people known around Kentuckiana, a derby-winning jockey and a local Paralympic athlete. WHS 11's Brooke Katz talked with one of the athletes and got reaction to those pictures. Picture after picture of buff bodies, athletes taking it all off for the cameras. It definitely has made me feel more comfortable with my skin. Oksana Masters from Louisville is just one of 27 athletes featured in ESPN's Body Issue. Each year, the magazine picks from athletes at the top of their games who've pushed their physiques into new frontiers. Masters is getting ready to compete in rowing during the Paralympic Games in London. Everyone's just there staring at you, and then it's got the ESPN, you know, photo director, and the ESPN, like, you know, the Body Issue for editor and stuff. And I was like, oh my God, <laughs> this is awkward. Throughout the pages, athletes strike poses with their bodies strategically positioned. Another familiar face? Kentucky Derby winning jockey Mike Smith. Also featured football players, hockey players, and even some of the athletes heading to the Olympic Games. We hit the streets to find out what those in Kentuckiana think of the issue. A strong is beautiful or, or something like that. What do you think when you look at these pictures? Strong is beautiful and it is nice and it's just give you something different to look at. Do you think that this is a good rep representation for the Olympic athletes? Honestly, no. no I, I just, I kind of don't get why they're doing it. I mean, I, I, I don't see, you know, the reason behind it. The body is beautiful when it's handled in the proper way and it's developed in the proper way. So it seemed as though it showed the best of all things. For Masters, the reason behind the shoot is personal. I did the photo shoot kind of just like for myself and just kind of for the bigger picture of like um, breaking that mold of the stereotypical, you know, what people think is beauty. And she says the pictures show how sweat, tears, and hard work pay off. Brooke Katz, WHAS 11 News.